Layers of the Earth. Our Earth is divided up into three main layers based on composition, density, and physical properties. These three main layers are the core, mantle, and crust. Within these three layers are subdivisions and variations. The core is the hottest and densest part of the Earth and can be found at its center. It is divided up into two parts, the inner core and the outer core. The inner core is extremely hot but remains solid due to the extreme pressure at the center of the Earth. The outer core is a liquid layer made up of mostly of molten iron and nickel. The movement of the liquid outer core generates the Earth's magnetic field. The mantle is between the core and the crust. It is made up of hot, solid rock that flows very slowly and makes up most of the Earth's volume. The mantle's movement creates convection currents, which are like giant circles of circulating material. These currents are responsible for the movement of tectonic plates on the Earth's surface. The mantle can be divided into the upper mantle and the lower mantle. The lower mantle is closer to the core and under higher pressure, while the upper mantle is closer to the crust and more rigid. The outermost layer of the Earth is the crust. It's what you're standing on. It's relatively thin compared to the other layers, and is divided into two types, continental crust and oceanic crust. The oceanic crust is beneath the oceans and is thinner than the continental crust. The continental crust is found beneath the land, like the continents, and it is thicker than the oceanic crust. Two other layers that are variations of the three main layers are the lithosphere and the asthenosphere. The lithosphere includes both the crust and the portion of the uppermost rigid mantle. It is divided into tectonic plates and encompasses the solid, brittle, and relatively cool portions of the crust and the uppermost part of the mantle. The asthenosphere is located beneath the rigid plates of the lithosphere. It is a part of the upper mantle and is made up of semi-solid, hot, and ductile rock. It facilitates the movement of the tectonic plates of the lithosphere. The main layers of the Earth are the core, mantle, and crust, with the lithosphere and asthenosphere also being important regions within the Earth. Thank you for watching another Adventures in iSTEM and Beyond video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications for more Adventures in iSTEM and Beyond videos. ideas on how to incorporate science, technology, and skills for life into your classroom, go to adventuresinistem.com.